So this bathroom is what I worked on today here in the remodel. Got some painting, a little bit of painting to do, and I've got to re mud and sand that guy. But uh put the flooring in and uh put a toilet in. I'm gonna have to figure out a way to sink that to meet the uh, floor there. Got to put a new piece of trim right back there. And because of my ugly cut jobs, I've got to uh, get this piece of trim up right, right, right there. A couple of nails. It should be good. But um, what is that white spot? Is that a ref that's a reflection. That's light. Is that light? What? 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 Oh, it is. Okay. <sighs> Scared me. It's like, what? What is that? But, uh, yeah. So I painted all this, this new color, sea salt, instead of the, the blue that it was. I'm gonna put some caulk on here. Figure out a way to make that prettier. But, um, put the toilet in. The stem and the line are original, so it's kind of ugly. And you can see the where the blue was versus the sea salt. So I caulked and painted that top layer of trim there. And I think this part here I'll put quarter round down. But uh, yeah, new toilet. I haven't used it yet. Brand spanking new. Ooh, pretty. So right now the water is probably potable, but uh, yeah, anyway. This is the bathroom redo for the day. I've got to put a little piece of trim there, but then whoever put the house be before didn't. Oh, so I'm going to have to maybe bevel it at a 24 and a half degree because I've got to cover that spot. I've actually cut this a little bit. And then a bead of silicone, white silicone, just around that edge. But I'll put the trim pieces there and there first. Yeah. And then this weird shower bath thing. Look at that. They raised it. That's that's all dead space. Just a little bit of access to the plumbing on the other side of the wall. But, man, they really... Hey buddy, what are you doing? That's our fake panel. Fake door. Real fake doors here. Uh, anyway. House is coming along. Uh, let's go show you the front porch. Mm -hmm. There you go, we're out of darkness. Ooh. Have I shown you my lights? Cool lights, huh? Here's the kitchen. Wow! <laughs> Except this line goes to there and it should go to there. So the whole thing is a little bit <laughs> at an angle. So, whoops. But yeah, Jennifer's living in Savannah, Georgia. I'm living in Lafayette. This is my countertop. I'm gonna put a new countertop in. Gondor thinks he's going outside. You're not! You're not going outside. Here, I'll turn the porch light on so we can see what's how beautiful it is. Gondor! Gondor, come here! Come here! Gondor, no! I need you to go outside. Come here. We'll get some grass for you. Come on, let's get some grass. Come on. Silly goose. Sneaking out. Toasty, go back inside. Here, here's some grass. Eat your grass. My goodness. Beautiful, beautiful new paint. Jennifer and I put this uh, little garden together here. And uh, here's the porch, complete with white rocking chairs. Now, you'll notice these hooks on the side and the hook latches up there. These are for curtains. It's gonna look really pretty, real pretty. That B board, that new light that I chose, 
I kind of like it. So it's a good, uh, good house. Beautiful blue door. I took the storm door off, and that blue just makes it spanking, spanktastic, spanktastic. Yeah, you little vermin. What are you doing? No, front door, no. Shoot. I'll kick you in the face. This is what's left. I've been slowly but surely taking the, uh, taking everything apart. Some books that I wrote. Some artwork. Lots of artwork still needing to be processed, put away. Leonardo and Donatello there. I'm gonna watch, what's it called? Yosemite? Something like that. TV show, Yukon? I don't know. Kevin Costner. It's okay. Yep. <laughs> the couch is kind of a hodgepodge of work right now. Dusty, what are you thinking? What's for supper? Yar. Oh. Yeah. <sighs> it's a whirlwind. This is the sink here. Butcher block countertop. So, <clears throat> probably not tomorrow. But I've got to pop all this stuff off of there. Get rid of the countertop. Clean the cat litter. <laughs> so much work to do. Gotta clean this room, put away everything. Install the new light up there. Hook up this new vent hood that I put up. It's not hooked up yet. I don't think it is. No. I tied it in. Food. Jennifer was mad because I threw away all the food in the fridge. Now all that's left is my food in the fridge. Including, but not limited to, the Zero Candy Bar. That's willpower for you. Stay there. Don't move. Got some leftovers. That's what I've been doing. Eating a one order of leftovers every other day. What I mean, order of food. Go out to eat every other day. Just keep myself sane in human contact. <clears throat> because I've been living with cigarettes, but I've been living by myself, and it's boring. So, go to the store, get some human contact. These are the curtains. All ready to go. Just decided to keep them clean. But I've got to move all this furniture too. Man. And I've got to find this brown paint. It's a rare, everything else is sea salt. We've only got two areas that are brown. But <clears throat> some of the stuff like this, I'm probably just going to put on the curb. But, uh, <clears throat> oh, I got to feed my cats too. Oh, no wonder they're so anxious. Do you even have clean water? Toasty? Do you forgive me for all my sins? So I have been a vacant guy today. All right then, boy. Toasty has a problem with his butt. He doesn't clean it. So they've been on a diet. Oh, dieting my cats. Gunnar went in on the action. He's going to sniff me. What's Dad doing? Dad's back inside. Goodbye, Dad. You need food? You guys hungry? But you are. Oh, I choose you. And I'll choose you over and over and over. Without pause, without a doubt, in a heartbeat, I'll keep choosing you. 
That's how I feel about my beautiful wife. I miss her. More than my heart can bear. I miss my wife dearly. Gondor's going to learn how to play the mandolin. <laughs> the more I move stuff around, the more curious they get. I wouldn't let them in the bathroom all day, and they were furiously, curiously. Clean your butt. Oh, that's a beautiful house. I'm just tired of working on it. Tired of taking things to the garage. Anyway, I guess I'll log off and take a shower, watch some TV, and go to bed and read the Bible, fall asleep. What do you think about that, Toasty? Maybe I'll clean your cat litter, too. Hmm. Self-control and willpower... <sighs> are um, becoming easier. When, at one time in my life, I smoked half a cigarette in a day. I worked on the, all the way up to a couple months ago, I was smoking half a pack a day. And uh, now I'm back down to five. So that's good. Better if I quit all the way. It would be better. That's Ed. Laughing. Mischievously. Here's one of the funny things about this house that Jennifer ended up doing. She put in some cool switches, but now they're dirty, so I have to get the cleaner to come clean them. I'm going to hire a cleaner. Once everything is remodeled and done, finished, like fixing stupid lights like that, just places that just need to be fixed. All right, time to do the cat litter. Toasty, I'm going to clean your cat litter. What do you think about that, huh? You good boy. Toasty. Toasty. Okay. I'm just glad I don't have dogs. Huh.